Hello there, ladies and Mason here with another NASCAR Heat 4 video. Today we're going to be doing Matt Kemp's last win, and that was 2017 at Phoenix. The reason we're doing this is because he's making his rightful return to NASCAR. So he'll be replacing the 42 of Kyle Larson due to uh, some problem. Some words have said. <laughs> Let's open it. So as you can see in the bottom left will be the uh, livery I'm trying to replicate, and yeah, so let's, let's begin building this. So the 2017 car, he drove a Toyota in the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series. So we're going to go there. And we're going to wait for it. Oh, there we go. Del Jr.'s if he doesn't look quite as good now in the Toyota. But I'm sure Matt Kent's if he will look fantastic. So what we're going to do, we're going to change these up so I can tell the difference between the liveries. And that looks horrendous, but it's all part of the learning process. And I think that might be the one just there, actually. Let's have a flick through. I think that's the one. So, what we're going to do, we're just going, yeah, that's the one. So, what we're going to do, work all the way from the left. We go all the way to the left, and we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 across. So, 9 from the left. And that gives us our paint scheme and I'm sure eagle eye viewers will be and um, regular viewers of the channel will be able to see where I'm going with this it, so what we're going to do we're going to go for pure white for the top stripe one which is this dark red we're just going to go for the bright red stock and for here we're going to go for the stock orange and that doesn't look too bad I must admit so I may make some changes. I may end up making the uh, red a bit darker, but that might just be because of the picture. So we're going to go down one. Uh, so there's your purple, there's your purpley pink color, and we go one, two, there. As for this orange, I want it a bit lighter, so we go up one more. Which so uh, here's your yellow. There's that. It's the crossover part. So yeah, I think that looks a lot better. It looks a bit. The orange is a bit brighter and the red's a bit darker to match the uh, paint skin we're trying to replicate. So let us carry on and go to the number. Obviously we're going to make the car the number 20 and there it was. Uh, there's no 20D unfortunately because that would look perfect but we're going to go for 20B and we're going to keep it with the stock white to replicate the, uh, the real life Matt Kensif. It's a shame we can't make the roof red to match, but obviously limitations within the game. So what's he's what he's done? He's gone for pure black wheels in the uh, reference picture, and that's what we're going to be doing there. So what we do is it's the fourth across from the left, and that gives you the uh, paint scheme side of the car. As for the sponsor, let's have a look. See what we got. So we got a big red square. And that's going to be difficult to replicate. Um, I want to see the hood better. Thank you. And I suppose because it is red, you could go for Axler. That'd be a good start. Um, shutter systems may be good because obviously you get the orange at the bottom. But the logo is predominantly red. So that's what we're going to have to try and work with. So you could probably go for Hunt Brothers Pizza because of that. V might be a better choice, I must admit. Even though it's not square, it's predominantly red with the white centre part. And that could be our best option there. As we flick through, Mac Tools doesn't match. Um, Lumia doesn't match. So there's not a lot that match. So I'm going to go for Reem. Uh, the red square. Red circle, sorry. And there we go. And that looks near. It's not perfect, but it's the best within the limitations of the sponsors that they have given us in the game. For the side, there is a lot of small sponsors. Um, I'm going to leave it as nothing, but if you want some small white writing, you can go for China's Hospital for Children, Pro Care, and the like. And it's, you know, or even Can-Am. Can-Am would work actually quite well. But it's they're all below that orange line, which is important, and it makes it look semi-decent. So I'm going to leave that as none for the moment. And you can't see the bar because it's pure white. So we're going to try and find some red writing. I think firearm service looks really good, actually. So 
They stick through, see if we find the red writing. Hootus looks alright, but Axa would look good, but the problem is it's the Port Four logo and on the car it's just red writing. So we're flicking through, going through, we got Macintosh. Rico would be good, but I feel the best alter best option will be this um fire alarm services. There we go. And we're going to try and match that throughout the rear of the car as well. So we're going to have the fire alarm services at the uh deck lid of the car and we're going to have it on the rear TV as well. And that gives off this car nicely. And I think that's a very good replica of Matt Kensif's last win at Phoenix, which was in 2017. Hope he does well in his return. And what we're going to do, we're going to try and replicate that win up shortly at Phoenix. So stick around to see that because we'll be going to Phoenix right now. So here we are at Phoenix. Starting eighth position. Um, oh, there's me nearly spinning out Carl Larson. So you can see. I like the car. The car looks accurate, but it also looks really cool. So I'm really chuffed to that result. So yeah, I'm I'm content. I hope you guys like the livery as well. And if you have any recommendations of what livery I should do next, please comment and tell me. Um, I'm enjoying doing what the uh, liveries that people like. So you can see me fight with Denny Hamlin there on the screen. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Remember to like, subscribe, comment and the liking. Let's see if I win this race as well. Yeah, it's uh, You see I'm fighting so hard with the two Toyotas there. <laughs> but I hope to see you next time. Remember to subscribe to keep track of all the custom liveries that I'll be doing. And let's hope that Matt Kenseth is able to really do well in his comeback in 2020. So as you can see, we're getting towards the end of the race. It's me <laughs> nearly spit crashing out. And there's uh, me on the last lap making the pass for the lead on the final lap. And we go across the line to win at Phoenix. So we've replicated Matt Kenseth win as well. So winner, winner, chicken dinner. Remember to like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you for the next video. For the next custom livery, which hopefully will be out tomorrow. Until then, enjoy!